Hey mom, just letting you know I'm gonna be babysitting Mrs. Johnson's kid tonight uh, till 11, so I'll see you later. Love you, bye-bye. Hi. Here. Perling. If I put this in here. Uh, okay. Uh, this is Sam King. Test shot one. Night. No. Oh, babe. How long are we gonna wait? It's been like two weeks already. I'm just not ready yet, okay? Babe, are you fucking kidding me? On, bitch. No, 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 no. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Just go back to bed, bud. Okay. Hey, Jamie. Hey, Sam. Hey, Jamie. Uh, wait, can I ask you a question? Yeah, sure. What's up? I just... Do you like to read? I mean, have you ever heard of Sid Vicious? Yeah, he's, um... He's that guy from that one band, right? Yeah, yeah. I'm reading this book about him for summer school. It's actually really interesting. Cool. What's it about? Well, Sid Vicious, the basis of the Sex Pistols, fell in love with this girl, Nancy. And... For the first time in his life, he was really happy. Mm. And it wound up being getting ripped out from underneath him because of the whole drug scene, and then he wound up killing her and killing himself. Mm. Pretty sad, huh? Uh -huh. <laughs> I really like these kind of books. It shows that anything can happen in this kind of world. It's full of surprises. And I guess in the end, love kills. And I guess you're right. The world is far from perfect, you know? So what happened to your face? Oh, this? Oh, it's nothing. I, um, I bumped it on a desk while I was cleaning up for Mrs. Johnson's kid last night. You know I heard you guys last night, right? You shouldn't take that stuff lightly. 
Hey, sorry, I gotta go. I just remembered I have to do homework or something. But it's summer. Jamie, wait! Yeah? Do you want to get coffee with me sometime? What? Do you want to get coffee with me or something sometime? Uh, sure, I'd like that. Pick me up at eight? You look nice. Thanks. So where are we going? Uh, thought we go downtown to the Java joint. There's a band on there on Friday. Cool. Cool. Hey I'm, hey, I'm really sorry about what I... Sam, it's fine. Seriously, it, it wasn't a big deal. Will I see you tomorrow? Uh, yeah, I guess so. Thanks again. that guy. Who is that? Him? He's just a friend, Travis. A friend? Really? A fucking friend? Where have you been for the last four hours while I was sitting here? I was at the waiting. Java joint. Oh, tough, really? Were you fucking him? Are you fucking that you guy? You think I'm fucking him? Yes. Are what else are you doing? Are you serious, Travis? Yes, I am. Jamie, listen to me. 
I'm sorry. I'm sorry for whatever the fuck I did to ever hurt you, but listen to me. I love you, okay? I love you more than that guy. Fucking give a shit Don't about you. Don't fucking ever lay a hand on me again. Jimmy, I swear. You understand? I swear I will never hurt you another day as long as I live. You better not. I promise not. that to you. I promise you, Jamie. I love you. Okay? I love you too. I love you. I love you so much. Come inside. Mom, hi. Yeah, I am babysitting for Casey again. Till 11. Mom, I know I can't have Travis over while I'm babysitting. I wouldn't do that. Love you too. Bye. No, Travis. No, I'm not. I'm not ready yet. Please, please, no. Please. <laughs> well, go get it. Hey, I just wanted to apologize again for yesterday, and here's the book I was reading. <laughs> Who's at the door? Oh. It's your friend. <laughs> you Hey yo, get the fuck off my hood, you creep. Did you hear me? I said get the fuck off, bitch. No. Get the fuck off my car before I hit you so hard. Fuck you. I'm not a fucking creep. Oh, you're messing with the wrong dudes. Dude, yo. Down, Come on, Hello? Down, Come on, you Hello, Travis. Fuck you! Fuck you!
on you. Sam, let me go. Sam, let me go. was willing to let you go, yet you always went running back to him. Why? Why do people like him always attract people that he pushes away? He didn't deserve you, Jamie. He didn't deserve you. You're just as guilty as he was. push you away and you would just go running back to him. Well, I sat here, open eared and arm, waiting for you. Why? Was it because I ran to you like you ran to him? I made it pretty fucking clear I care about you. something worth running towards. I never knew what I wanted out of life. Sometimes everybody around me had something handed to them on a silver platter and I envied them. But you... You were something that none of them had. You were something that if I could obtain I wouldn't need anything else.
So here I stand, finally having what I've always chased. And you know what, Jamie? I don't need to chase anymore! <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.